Today I'm going to review the Aero Air Stapler. I wasn't sure what kind of staples to get. These appear to fit most standard types of uh, hand staplers. Wasn't sure if it'll work on the Air Stapler, but it does kind of read T50 staples and that says T50 staples genuine, so they should work. Let's find out. My air gun's already set up, and here we go. We got some air gun oil. I think there's only halfway full. Doesn't matter, I already have some right here. Yep, there it is. I guess they figure whoever's buying this, it's their first time or something. Just doing this with one hand, so I'll just edit that out. It appears it already has the air gun attachment. So that's uh, fantastic. Let's use what they have equipped for us already. I do see some Allen wrenches in here, probably for some later on adjustments. Okay, I got the oil in. I went a little heavy with it because it's my first time using it. Let me go get my airline. I bought this at the Home Depot. So whatever information that provides you with. And it's in. Oh, that's pretty easy to operate. Moment of truth. Do I have to run all the way back to the Home Depot? Hold on, I'm going to put the phone down. They're small. I'm just going to do some Tyvax around this thing. And that's how I'll test it out. Very aggressive staples. So far, so good. It fits. My shadow's in the way. It appears to be one staple at a time. Not one staple, but one coil at a time. Ah, uh, I have to push down on the trigger. Shot a little deep. I'll have to adjust it. Searching for where I adjust it. I don't see where to adjust it at. Uh, I think I'll have to adjust it at the uh, compressor end. That's what I'll do. No big deal. No big deal at all. I think 90 will do. Let's give it a shot. Literally. See how that little mechanism works? Pretty cool. Um, not perfect. Oh, look at that. I can actually pull the trigger then ram it perfect perfect amount of air pressure too okay i gotta get to work and i'm gonna turn the camera off and i'll let you know how it goes okay i got pretty much all the tyvex up here and my honest review of this tool is that it's really cheap i guess it's already starting to rust for mysterious reasons and um it's misfiring a lot and I'm lost you see that there was a rubber piece on that I did not leave it in the rain it didn't even rain but it's super humid so these parts are starting to rust the uh, gun seems to misfire a lot let me see if I can I, I notice if you hold it and then push it that double shot, see, it does that a lot too. Now see, that one did not shoot at all. I found that if you hold the trigger and push, 
it's far more likely for a misfire. But if you go like this, oh, it misfired. There it is. Yeah, a lot of missed shots, but still easier than using a hand stapler by far. For $10 more, it's definitely worth it opposed to using a hand stapler if you have, of course, an air compressor. So if you have the air compressor, definitely this is far superior to using a hand stapler. It's set at 90 pounds of pressure, so I don't know if that's the reason that it's misfiring. See, misfired. Double shot, but one of them was a misfire. Misfire. Got one. There was none. Yeah, it's getting a little frustrating. A lot of misfires. It is oil. Just go like that. You'll get a few. might be out let's see it's easy to at least open it no it's not out it's just misfiring a lot okay definitely better to just pull the trigger it's not really good to ram it in it's not firing right Sorry if my enthusiasm sounds a little low today. It is hot. Yeah, today's a scorcher. And I'm building a greenhouse, so it is excruciatingly hot. And um, my energy is real low. But as far as this review, this is definitely better than a hand stapler. It's definitely worth the price. Uh, if you need something more reliable, they sell more expensive guns. But you have to be honest with yourself. What do you really need it for? Is it a one-time use? Is it a small job? Are you going to use this every day? Got to be honest with yourself. It's not the best, but it is probably the best price. I mean, I am not complaining about it because of the price was so cheap. I think it was like 30 something bucks. But yeah, I mean, so much faster than a hand stapler. So much more worth it. I mean, a premium hand stapler was just about the same price. I might as well just get a cheap air gun. It already came with the valve too, which is that in itself is a value. I mean, it is a hand, it is a working gun. It does work. So for the price, you can't complain. It will get the job done. It's just misfiring. And it might just be this specific one, but I'm pretty sure they're all gonna be misfiring like that. But it's so easy to just put another staple in. You can't really complain about it. Just keep going, just keep going. Not a big deal. Your life doesn't depend on it.